and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 Serenity's Tale with me, Little Miss Simmer. So we are back. I had a massive dilemma. I previously recorded this video and the file got corrupted. I know, um, but I wasn't that proud of it proud of it anyway so i'm back um i will fill you in on what happened last time so serenity was home alone in the house cameron had wandered off somewhere and he wasn't at home so she decided to you know wander around and do some snooping you know there's all these files lying around on top of the fridge there in the in the library and um she went wandering up into the attic and she found these plants now you know i i know nothing about these these must be some kind of alien substance they're definitely not human and she's just wondering why the hell he didn't tell her about these what are they and why is he growing them we'd never seen him go up into the attic so we never knew it was there and he always has this money but he doesn't work so it's sort of if you put two and two together you sort of make the assumption that they that is where he's getting his money from it would also explain how i mean why mortimer goth was um round and we and we didn't know why because we weren't friends with him or anything um excuse the banging because my front door is like really stuck and every time like you open a shutter, it makes a massive bang and there's also fireworks as well because people can't get over the bonfire night was like five nights ago and people are still doing fireworks um but yeah so that's the whole dilemma with that she sort of left things out when she went snooping and he's probably gonna know that someone's been rummaging around up here but she she had to, she had to find out it just seemed too good to be true there was you know he was hiding something and he definitely was so that wasn't all she found she went down into the basement where she just assumed you know there would just be a bunch of you know art stuff or not even art stuff just stuff and there was and then there were the files here again and canvases and boxes and old pictures on the walls um but in the next room <laughs> serenity can now make fun of noobs <laughs> okay then girl um in the next room there was kid stuff and she's immediately thought why why i didn't know he had a daughter or anything like that so she was she was confused and she i guess she know she knows that he must have a kid but she just hasn't confronted him about it yet so she's doing a bit of video gaming we also um her needs are pretty good she, she's all happy we're gonna stop doing that she also went snooping on his computer um you know well there's another file there looking at the photos of his family and you know we just sort of went digging around the whole house house so yeah he's gonna do a little bit of tidying but i guess we should i guess this is the time to confront him um so yeah i'm gonna get her to maybe where are you going girl where are you going um maybe he can come up here and sit next to her or is he oh no he's not he's using the tv downstairs um but yeah so i'm recording this audio second hand like i'm not it's not when i was actually playing because i went to edit this and my microphone hadn't recorded so fun times but we are going to go ahead and we are going to butter him up a little bit we're going to cushion the blow because we're about to you know let him know that we know some of his deepest darkest secrets that for some reason he felt like he couldn't tell us you know our, our friendship bar isn't all the way to the end so we know that they you know they, they they're friends but they're not best friends even though they've got a lot of chemistry and you know the pink bar is all the way to the end she wants to get to know him well we definitely we definitely need to get to know him because we don't know everything that we need to know so she knows that he's hiding things um we'll be a little bit flirty make it look like there's nothing wrong or laughing and joking and i really need to change his voice it's too low i really don't like it i keep forgetting and then every time he speaks it's like oh wait what? Oh, every time he speaks, it's like, Ugh, I hate, I hate, 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 hate your voice. Um, kiss him, do all that jazz, snuggle up with him, make a move. Uh, she's just like waiting, what now, what now? But yeah, 
we're just gonna sort of let him know it's not a secret anymore because while you were out i went and found out your secrets for myself because you weren't telling me why are they gonna get up right now is the time so we are going to have ask him about his day where have you been why why were you out why were you out all day what you know she was home alone and she got curious so she started to go snooping but where were you where did you go um we will get to know him try and learn a few more things about him try and ease them out of him without seeing like we're being intrusive um she's got a little aspiration on points or whatever they're called um She's gonna Mommy? age up in like four days. Oh my god! I'm gonna need to find a way to age her back down because I don't want her to be an adult and get wrinkles. I really don't. Um, so yeah, they get they're getting on quite well. We'll talk about handiness. Try and take it off the subject. You know, make it seem like it's just a normal conversation. But really, she's really subtly prying and trying to get it out of him. Um, ah, so cute. Um. We'll tell a story. Yeah, we'll be really funny. sarcastic and tell him a funny story. Super you know, I was I was walking on Jolly. the first floor and yeah, I just fell down wrong. the stairs into the basement one you're day, you know. Yeah. And then really I saw llamas and they were <laughs> they were spinning and it, it was it was so funny. And he's there like, okay, she knows, she knows what she saw. It's time to reveal the deep secret. So I guess now he's gonna tell her. I have a daughter. <gasps> She's pretending to be surprised, like, oh, well, I already knew that. Um, <laughs> very sarcastic conversation. So let's have a deep conversation, you know, maybe explain why he felt he couldn't tell her. Give her a few reasons. She's like, why didn't you tell me, dude? Like, she's not one of those women that's just going to run at the first sign of baggage. I think everyone becomes has baggage, so they're going to become best friends. Now that they know, every, well, she doesn't. Well, he know most things, even though he doesn't know that she knows about the parts in the attic just yet. I don't think she's ready to drop that bombshell just yet, but it's still it's still not all the way to the end. But we're getting there. So, um, if you'd have seen the video that I uploaded before uploading this part, you would have seen me create Kayla, his daughter, Kayla McGee, and I think today we should meet her. Um, maybe invite her round for breakfast and try to get to know her this is very it's going to be a very you know awkward scenario for serenity so we are going to invite to hang out our current lot uh kayla and hopefully she'll be right over and she will get on with serenity as she hopes she will it's going to be very awkward because you know he, he her dad's got a new girlfriend and most people in those situations want their parents to be back together she says kayla will be right over brilliant um we're going to psych ourselves up in the mirror, freshen up, brush our teeth, make ourselves presentable. We want to make an impression on her. We want her to like us. We might even give her a little makeover so that she doesn't look so mysterious in her fitting outfit. Her fitting two-piece and her cat, her cat ear. What are they called? Cat ear shaped glasses or something? I've forgotten. Right, well, she's here. Cat eye sunglasses. It's the cat eye sunglasses. There's something like that. They're shaped like cat ears or cat eyes. I don't know but she's wearing them so yeah she's freshening up he's going to um you know say well my girlfriend's here and i want you to meet her because obviously she's thinking she's just coming to see her dad she's like oh okay uh i wasn't expecting that <laughs> um <laughs> so she's shocked like <gasps> um but yeah so we're gonna express our admiration nope we're gonna ask about her day start a bit of general chit chat we're gonna come and we're gonna sit together in the kitchen before making some scrambled eggs for breakfast right so any stop playing games we are not here to mess around and play games we um we've got important business going on down here and you need to make a really good impression so come and sit come and sit down here he's feeling very playful he's always excited maybe hiding the fact that he's secretly dying inside that this could go horribly wrong so she's strutting her way into the kitchen with the ultimate sass and she's like i'm not having none of this i'm leaving i automatically don't like her and she's like um why have you left <laughs> come back so she's gone and followed her 
back into the kitchen. Not the kitchen, the hallway. She's like, hello? I'm not that bad, really. I don't bite. I just walk in a sophisticated fashion. Um, so yeah, we'll discuss interests with her. Let's see what she likes. We'll flatter her. She's got a nice outfit. They have seem to have a very similar style. We'll give her a hug and say hello. He's reached... She's reached level 6 of the Christmas skill, which is nice. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Extinguish yourself. Oh, my God, oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. <laughs> This is not going well. Oh my god, he stinks. This is not going well. This is not going well. Serenity, take over from the cooking because you clearly have, you know, way better than him. He's just trying to burn down the house and completely sabotage this. You need to go and have a shower. Where's the shower? We don't, we don't, we don't. Oh my god. How long have we gone in this house without a shower and I haven't even noticed? We need to put a shower in. Oh my god. Right. Where am I going to put it? Downstairs? No, I'm probably going to have to make upstairs the washroom with the shower and the bath in and we'll just have the toilet downstairs so i'll hop into build mode this shouldn't take me too long and change everything so we'll put a shower in i'm trying to make it fit without actually having to take anything out but i think i'm gonna have to completely revamp the whole thing so we'll get rid of her pink towel move the sink even though that's not gonna be level Ugh. all right we'll just leave that there let's take this out the shower's still not gonna fit and um, even if i put move objects on she still won't be able to get in there so um we'll just take everything out completely start from the beginning place down a shower and place down a nice modern bath and place it right there I like to have the shower, I like, I don't like to have it all on one side, like, I like it to be even. And I reckon we could fit the toilet back, so. Put the toilet back. Put that there against the wall. Put the sink back in. This is going to be so crammed. But you gotta do what you gotta do. We, need, we could so build a bigger bathroom in this house, but I just, I'll probably do it off camera, because it'll be boring to watch. Right, we got the loo roll. We try and put her pink towel back in near the shower and there we go right so you can come and have a shower now oh no i need to put the mirror right it was this one was it this one um and there we go right the bathroom is complete now we can go and we can freshen up because we absolutely stink no we're not talking to that lady <laughs> We are having a shower. She's finishing off the eggs that he nearly burnt down the house with. I'm um, going to take a screenshot because he absolutely stinks and this is hilarious. His daughter is probably like, you've seriously embarrassed yourself. Um, at least it wasn't Serenity who embarrassed herself, I guess. Right, we'll brighten her day. We'll have a little chat with her. Hopefully she'll come and grab some. Why is this freezing? Um, we will... Oh. Well, if for some reason we can't call to meal, I don't know why. For some reason we can't, so we'll go and grab a serving together. Stop eating the one you have. Go and grab one together, and hopefully she'll eat. If I put it in front of her, nope. She doesn't want to eat it. She's like, what if she's trying to poison me? No, there's freaking food everywhere now. Sit and eat. We can't even control her. Let's just speak to her then. She doesn't want to eat the food. She doesn't want to eat the food, even though she came round to eat the freaking food. Um, compliment her Lots outfit yeah. <laughs> we will she's cheerful that's nice um we'll flash crazy eyes this is definitely a photo moment meeting the daughter for the first time but she's got the shades back on because she just will not let go um and i'm loving her nails here we go take another one there we go. But she can't even see her eyes because she's wearing glasses. Um, let's give her some repair tits because we all know how Serenity loves to do that. Um, yeah, so that's all we really know about her. All we know is that she's cheerful. 
just keep talking to her and we'll have a deep conversation with her you know sort of say i hope this isn't awkward i hope there's nothing between us just because i'm with your dad now i hope you don't like hate me I'll turn that telly off because no one's watching it. Oh, and he's come back to join us. Whimsical achievement. I don't even know what that means. All right, she's wandered off again. Complete 20 whims. Oh, okay. Stop feeling flirty. You're meeting the daughter. Is it the stepdaughter? Would she be like the stepmom? I don't know if that's only if you're married. I think it is. If when you get married, you become the stepmom. Oh, right, let's try and get her back in the room. Let's ask about her career. See if she comes in. She's a medical student. And so, you know, that's another thing. How is he affording to pay her school fees when she's training to be a doctor or a nurse or whatever? She's at the high She's a, a student, a high school student at Buckingham High. That sounds very elite. Ask her about her love life. She can hang out for a bit. Tell an unbelievable story because she's got plenty of those to tell. Um, and we will propose a crazy scheme. Maybe those two are like scheming to go off when the dad's out. I don't know, go shopping or something. And that weird black thing on her neck's really annoying me. I don't know if it's the hair or like. Because she's not her hair is not a CC hair, so it must be the top because the top's custom content. But I think I'm pretty sure, and so I don't know why that's happening. Right, she's off. She's had enough. She's done. And he's gonna eat his eggs, and we're gonna change back into something more every day. There we go. She's still got the freaking shades on. I don't want her to have the shades on. We're at home. Take the freaking shades. No, we're not doing athletic. Right. Art of Two. I love that outfit. We definitely need to find one that's more everyday. They're all quite out there. Apart from the jeans one. But then again, she has the glasses on again. So you clean up. We are going to... She's going to pee. He's hopefully going to clean everything up. Clean up that as well. He needs to pee. Do this first. And then you can go to the toilets. His voice is so low. It just, my ears, it really annoys my ears. <laughs> it really does. Right, we'll turn off that television. And we'll go to sleep because she's got work in 19 hours. We got promoted to cadet in the part that I couldn't use because it was corrupt. She got promoted to cadet. Nothing much really happened. Um, it was just what we had been doing before. So it wasn't anything different. The plants... Don't need seeing too. Seeing as Serenity's asleep, he's probably gonna creep upstairs and check on them and with that evil laugh. Oh my god, that was such a dirty laugh. Oh my gosh, they don't need any attendance. They're pretty normal tentacle tree. This extraterrestrial tree. It seems to be all intertwined vines. I didn't get to read that before it disappeared. I know they're carnivorous or something. So I don't know if they can actually eat you. I don't even know if you can harvest anything from them. They're growing this they're glowing like this weird green stuff. He's obviously noticed that someone's taken all of the stuff out of the chest. And he's probably wondering who the hell has been looking for all of this. Um obviously it's Serenity, but he probably won't dare question her about it after knowing that she fell into the basement and saw the children's toys. But we've met the daughter now and they seem to get on pretty well. So yeah, she's sleeping. It's probably time for Cameron to go to bed too. It's only half two in the afternoon. But she's got a long shift ahead of her tomorrow. Um, in the next part, we will probably meet the mum. I'm not sure though. We might meet the mum. Um, the daughter's probably gone home and said, Oh my god, I met Serenity today. Who's Serenity? Serenity's dad's new girlfriend. Ah. She's probably like, I must meet her. Why is he introducing new women into your life? Blah, blah, blah. And she'll probably want to meet her. He ages up in quite a long time compared to Serenity does. Oops. Um, I do still need to find a way to age her down. I'm, I might do the whole death flower thing again. Um, but 
yeah i'll get her a little planter pot her own little pink planter pot so she can because she did used to be into gardening before we got kicked out of her house and moved into the asylum she was growing all her little roses and strawberries so she can get a bit into gardening again which would be nice and it would be nice to grow a death flower just in case something terrible happens because i would literally cry if serenity died i'd literally have to pretend it never happened i would be so sad <sighs> but yeah so yeah we need to stop stop playing games um he could cover up the whole um he could cover up the whole i i i can't even know what i'm saying he could cover up the whole um plant thing by saying that he's into gardening just like she is um but at the same time the actual plants themselves there's no explaining them because they are not from this planet clearly i have no idea what they are but he's growing them so yeah i'm gonna make him head to bed now but i think first we should socialize with kayla and ask her how she thought it went because he still doesn't know and we'll also send her a text in case she's not online and then we will head to bed an extremely extremely early night there we go get off there now and go to bed all right so that should go super speedy because they're both sleeping but yeah so we definitely have some complications still we have to go to a crime scene and go on patrol to get our next promotion but she's doing quite well considering she technically doesn't even need to work because he's making so much money but i guess it's all part of character building and improving herself being an actual detective so we're gonna have a lovely bubble bath before work and maybe because she has 12 hours we could go out and try to find some harvestables to plant in our new little pink planter pot that we have in the back garden so when she's done doing that oh, oh there's a ton of stuff over here there's a ton of stuff so what are these strawberries apples bluebell We'll harvest some of those. Pear tree, we'll harvest some of those. And I think these are roses. Yep, normal rose bush. Harvest lots of those. But she decides to hurry up and get out of the bath. There we go. I didn't even realise we live next to right all of this stuff. Um we got those. She's getting a bit hungry, but that's okay. Is there anything else? We can dig these. Dig that one. Oh, I hate it when it does that. No, I don't want to go here. Right, we'll dig those. I don't think there's much else around to get, to be honest. No, I thought there was more around here, but it doesn't look like there is apart from that big garden patch. There never, there's never any of the like rare stuff in Willow Creek. It's all in like Oasis Springs. Most of the really, really rare stuff. So she got a simitanium. We'll harvest these. Even though there are any snout dragons. What's this? More bluebells. Well, we'll get those before heading back. I don't think there's much else up here. Which they could have been, but they haven't put anything, so. We'll quickly run and do that. And then, level 3 of the gardening skill. We'll serve some dinner, because apparently it's dinner time. I never pay attention to sim time. Uh, we'll have some chilli. They just get tired when they get tired, so I can't, like, make them stay awake all day until night time. And sometimes it doesn't, like, go with their shifts and stuff, so... Her bum looks so big in those jeans. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she looks like she's been doing hella squats. Right, you're not eating this. So you can put this away right now. How rude. Can you not see her slaving away at the chili con carne? I don't know why there's ash on there. It's probably from the fire. You can brush your teeth. Wash your hands before you eat your meal. Make some coffee. Because you've just woken up. I don't know why... Um, sims can read and drink coffee but they can't eat and drink at the same time 
but they can do other things when you're at the same time. I don't know if EA just haven't clocked onto that yet. I might like tweet a sim guru and mention it to them and see if they're working on it because it, it's it's a little thing, but it, it's things like that that make the game more realistic. Right, stop drinking this. You need to come and grab some of this, please. No. Come and sit with Serenity, please. Right, she's eating hers. Stop drinking the coffee. Stop. Yes, place that down there. Grab your chili con carne. That's it. That looks so good. Um, right, drink that. Like, it, it'll, I'll click on drink, but he won't drink it till afterwards. I, if, but if that was a book there, he would he would read and drink. I, I, I think that's... Oh, his voice it's so easily it's, so, it's such a small thing if they can do it with the book they can do it with the food like it's it's simple like i think they just missed it but yeah i think i'm gonna enjoy their little dinner it's a little bit awkward i guess because she still doesn't know how to break to him about what she knows is going on in the attic but um but she'll figure it out she'll find the right time to to tell him right Oh, so he did drink the coffee. He did drink the coffee. He just took a sip of the coffee while eating his dinner. So maybe they do do that at the same time then. So normally when I when I ask them to, they don't. Maybe he just finished it, that's why. Right, we'll give him a suave kiss because she's feeling extra confident this morning. She's looking forward to work later after her promotion. And we're going to propose a crazy scheme. Maybe I should go and meet the mother. Maybe I should go and meet Kayla's mum. She'll love me. And he's there like, hmm, not so sure. <laughs> Maybe. Um, but that's definitely something I do want to do and see how that goes. You know, they might go on really well. He might be the piggy in the middle while they're sat there like gossiping about being with him and what it's like. I personally would hate that. If I ever at, at if I ever met like a boyfriend's ex and he was there and he was and he was she was there and she was like telling me things I'd be like no this is not okay I do not like this <laughs> I do not like it she's got a bunch of gaming books which I had her reading what's her skill video gaming eight what is programming four programming is only four um so we'll read something when we're programming th volume three we'll do a little bit of reading for work she doesn't come across as the educated type but she is um what is he doing his needs are pretty good do the plants need seeing too while she's reading they never seem to need anything they just they're just here Maybe that's why he's got away with it for so long because he hardly ever needs to come up and check on them. That definitely must be why he's got away with it for so long. Huh, right. We got another four hours, so we're gonna skip time a little bit. Um maybe read a gaming one instead now. We'll do gaming volume two. She's gonna go and sit in the dining room this time. She's bored of sitting in the library area. She's gonna sit down and read another book. We do need to put those all in the bookcase. I don't know why she's carrying them around. Um, and maybe grab a coffee for work. So we're super duper energized. Did she finish the book? She must have done. Oh, well, she's doing both now. Um, why? He reached level three of gaming. I love taking the picture when she's just doing everyday things. I don't know. I just love it. Uh, yeah, speed through she is an amateur amateur hour from reading feeling a little bored from reading a book that is low level what the what alone the words make sense but together what this book is beyond my skill okay <laughs> she read two books that were not right for her but oh well she read them. We're gonna go and use the toilet and brush our teeth and freshen up before work. Watch. Why can't they use that toilet? Be like a champion now. She's probably not gonna do it because for some reason we have two hours. It's right, for some reason she can't use that toilet. Look, we're gonna admire ourselves in the mirror. She's feeling so freaking confident. I love that she's like got back to her old bubbly self. Um, 
let's stop playing video games and play some sims forever instead he's always playing black block why are you laughing stop laughing <laughs> and then she's like <gasps> after hysterically laughing at herself so i think he starts work in about one hour so we will super speed she's probably gonna go back to the games room yep typical serenity she, until we go to work with her we're gonna join her i don't know how many days of like i think we've only done one day on camera i think um but she's only level two so you she i don't even know if she'll get all the way to level 10 she might even get to the point where she might rather be like a secret agent instead of a instead of a detective um especially like when she has children and stuff so that it's less full time i guess um while she's at work well we don't have to go to work with her to for it to affect her performance basically right are we there are we not there come on the screen right there we go we're at the police station and we need to travel to the crime scene but we don't even have a case so let's Construct a case at the board. There we go. And travel to the crime scene. Where we'll get some evidence and take some photos. I hope this isn't a long... I love, I love this game, but the loading screens just ruin it sometimes. Especially when there's so many of them. It, it just... Especially... It's more so when you're recording. Because then you notice it more. When you're not playing, you can go off and do something else. And then come back. Or, I don't know. Go off the game. Put, put a song on or something. Um, right, we've got some evidence outside. So we're going to collect this and take a picture. We've got more outside. I remember the first one we went to. There was none outside. It's all outside this time. There's so much evidence. It's everywhere. This isn't a very good criminal. Leaving his evidence everywhere. Right, so we've got some more. Oh, God, there's even more out here. Right, we'll collect some evidence sample. Take an evidence photo. Uh, Q is full, but we're nearly done. Doing pretty well. Right, she's already did that one, I think. Right, we need to get... Oh, there's more. There's even more. Right, we'll get a witness report from this lady standing outside. And do we need to get another one? Or, yeah. We need to get another one. Right, we'll talk to this lady who's wearing the very suspicious hair that Talia used to wear. That rhymes. <laughs> right, we'll go back indoors. Get a report from her. And then we'll return to the police station. She looks so much like Tyler, it's scary. They always have the blonde one as well. Like, I hardly ever see anyone with his hair in a different colour. Right, get another witness report. Is there even any more witnesses around? Oh, he's in the, He's getting out of the bath. <laughs> right, let's... Thank God he's getting out of the bath. We don't have to wait for him to finish his bath. Oh, she's hiding in her bed. She's embarrassed about something. These witness reports never seem to even help either. It always says, blah, 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 did not provide much information, blah, blah, blah. Right, so we're travelling back to trying to figure out who the naughty person things. is and what they've done. Does it even tell you what they've done? Normally you just have to go and find them. They give you like what they're wearing and what their hair's like and stuff and, and what their age is and you actually just have to go and find them. It doesn't actually tell you what they've done. Which would be fun. Right. She didn't provide much information. Nobody did. Um, yeah, none of them provided much information. Let's clear this. And it says to go and cross-reference the police database. So we will go in. We will do that. We'll kick someone off the computer. Right. We'll do the crime scene photos. <laughs> Aren't you doing that? Why is this so laggy today? My gameplay is not that great. Um... <laughs> Add clues to the crime map. This is my favourite bit. I love doing this. And seeing all the different things pop up. We discovered that the suspect is a geek. Okay. Right, we need to... 
Oh, we've got all these. If, is that if those objects make you a geek? Then wow. Um, we'll do another one, but this time we'll do it based on the reports instead of the photos, and see what we get. Even though they apparently didn't provide much information, I'm sure they'll give us something. Okay, we'll add clues again. We're doing very well today, guys. The suspect is wearing a short sleeve shirt. Okay. Um, let's do some analyzing evidence now. Let's analyze a sample. Her APB available. So only has enough clues to issue an APB at the crime act. Collecting more clues before issuing an APB will increase your ability to find the suspect. Okay then. Right. She hasn't got much logic, so um, this might not work. No, it didn't work. The anal analysis failed. Let's try again one more time. Even though we're wasting the evidence samples. Why have they placed a cork board in here with no freaking um, postcards on it? Right, it failed again, so let's just give up on that. Let's carry on with the cross-referencing. Cross we'll do more of the um, report things. This dude would get off the computer. If you don't get off, I'm going to sit on you. Oh, no, I'm just going to sit in you. Okay, then. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, we've done that. Doing so well today. We add more clues. Fill up the entire board. And we discover that the suspect... Why did I close that? Um... We'll do another one. I think there's another tiny little bit in the corner, but I'm not too sure. Right, and we'll add clues again. In this career, they stand around a lot, and I don't know why. Right, the subject is a geek, the subject is wearing a short sleeve shirt, and the subject is an adult. Right, there we go. We filled the entire board. Um, so there's no point searching the police database. We need to search criminals at the booking station. The criminal is certainly not in here based on the evidence and the clues that we have, so we'll just do these random ones because someone needs to do them. It makes me laugh when they start banging on the bars like this. Oh my god, her needs are bad. Her needs are really bad. Oh god. Right, let's go to the toilet. She's about to pee herself and that's not, that's not, you know, very authoritative peeing yourself in front of the, the criminals. Um... Right, now let's search the suspect again. The shift's nearly over, so I'm hopefully she can get through this. Come on. I don't know why they just stand around for so long. It takes forever to do everything because they stand around nodding their heads. And we're already staying late, so we can't extend the day even longer. Right, she's searching her for stuff. And we've done that. We need to take a police report from a civilian, so we'll try and do this guy. The workday will probably end by the time we get to him, though, because he's walking really slowly. Yeah. So we got 328 and a vacation day, and I think we will take that when, you know, t next in the next part when we actually want to do stuff instead of going to work. Um, I never normally use the vacation days, but I think I'll definitely be using them a lot when I don't want to go to work because I want to do other things so yeah so we are back at the house Umbridge Manor Serenity is absolutely exhausted so I'm gonna have her head to bed you're gonna stop watching the TV because that's gonna distract her and you can go and do something else please just get out of the room um, some kids have been running through the neighborhood <laughs> jumping pool jumping oh okay okay <laughs> that must have been what she got from the guy what she spoke to right we're gonna clean up this chili con carne and i'm gonna go ahead and end this part here so i really hope you enjoyed it and i will see you next time <laughs>